think they can spend more time together. And time now to check in with Carolina Sarasa. She's got a preview of what's coming up during the second hour of U News. Caro, happy Friday. Thank you, Andrea, and happy Friday to you as well. And today we're following a number of major stories. In South Florida, a detention center housing migrant children is the site of major controversy after officials announced a plan to provide long-distance mental health counseling for these children. And also, we have new details on the case of a missing teenager from West Virginia. Police making a major discovery in that case. And Andrea, it's been a rough week for pop singer Britney Spears. Just days after her manager said she may never perform again. Now, Britney has released a new message for her fans. That story and more today in minutes. So, back to you and happy Friday. Finally, Friday, right? Finally, finally, the weekend is almost here. Thanks so much, Kato. We'll be waiting for you. And now, here's a quick question. How many national parks in the United States have you been to? Well, whatever that number is, it's less than the number visited by Micah Meyer. And that's because he has visited every single one. Maiti Veriano has this incredible story. And after three years of traveling across the country, Micah Meyer has chosen Minneapolis as his new home for many reasons, primarily because it was here where his father first served as a pastor and because, and I quote, it's the only city in America with a large gay population where you can easily spend less than $1,000 a month on rent. I mean, what an amazing, amazing Incredible. journey. It must have been very tough living in that vehicle, in that van, but just amazing photographs that we saw there. Now, I was just wondering, does he plan on traveling some more and where to, perhaps? I hope so, and I hope he invites me, but for the now, he's going to be moving into Minneapolis. He's also working on a book and hoping to land his own travel show. So he's going to settle down for oh, yeah. a little bit. He's going to have a lot of experience to tell travelers where to go. Thanks so much, Mighty. That, that'll do it for us in the this month.